LowCarbRecipeIdeas.com. Today we're going to make a low-carb taco stuffed pepper. It is absolutely delicious. Um, the carb count's a little higher. I try not to make it too high, but it is a little bit higher. But peppers are really healthy. Um, everything that we're using is really healthy in this this uh, recipe. So let's get started, and I'll show you how to make. It. In my skillet, I have extra lean ground chicken. But you can use pork, you can use beef, it's up to you. So what we're going to do is we're going to break it all up and, and make it into small pieces while we're cooking. And I have a taco seasoning. And I've got two tablespoons of taco seasoning. Now I don't buy my taco seasoning. I make up my own, so you'll see it on the video, the recipe which is one tablespoon of chili, one teaspoon of cumin, one teaspoon of garlic powder, one teaspoon of paprika, half a teaspoon of oregano, half a teaspoon of onion powder, a quarter teaspoon of salt, and a quarter teaspoon of pepper. You don't use it all, but I have a little bit left over, but it's two tablespoons is what I put in with a pound of meat. So that's kind of how you make the decision as to how much spice to put in per pound with this taco seasoning. I have a small onion that I chopped up. So we're going to add that into the, the meat. So we'll have some nice flavor here. So we'll cook that for a few minutes and then we'll add the rest of our ingredients. I'm just going to um, set this aside, keep my, my temperature on very, very low. I'm going to put the cheese in after. Now we're just going to switch over and we're going to start working on our peppers. So I'm going to make three um, stuffed peppers. Now I have... Um, three of us in the house now because my mother has moved in with us so I'm just uh, having to make a little bit more food but it's just been a joy having her with us so we're talking cutting off the tops of our peppers then we are going to take and just take your knife along the sides and pull out the insides. So you do that with all three of them. Now green peppers we don't like. Green peppers are I find bitter but um, they are less in carbs and I'm sure there's many of you that like green ones so definitely use the green ones because they'll be just as delicious it's just that we're not as fussy on them so I'm just gonna use what we like. In fact, my husband's not fussy on peppers. He finds it gives him heartburn. But um, every once in a while, he'll break down. He'll have some. So I hate wasting things. So what I've done is I've taken the tops and I've chopped them up. And I'm just going to throw them in with the meat because I just don't want to waste them. Now, because I'm only making three of them, I've got a little um, meatloaf pan that fits perfect. They stand up nice and straight and we're going to start filling them. So we're just going to stir the peppers in to the meat mixture. And this is all going to be going into the oven so our peppers don't have to be totally cooked. And it's actually nice when they have a bit of a crunch when you're eating this. So the next thing we're going to do is I have a cup of shredded cheese, any kind of cheese you would like. It's up to you. I'm using marble cheese here. 
We'll stir this in and then we are going to be all set to stuff our peppers. Now it's time to stuff our peppers. Just put in a little at a time so I don't spill it all over the place. I probably have a too big of a spoon scoop to be using it this way. And like I said, you can choose what kind of meat you want to use. I bought I got this extra lean chicken because it was a good sale and this is what we were having for supper tonight and I was just trying to get the best price. So this is only three I'm making today but I have enough in here to to make five is what I would say so what I will do with my leftovers is I love it cutting up my romaine lettuce shredding some cheese taking the meat mixture putting it on top with some fresh tomatoes and then I don't even need seasoning because just the seasoning and the meat and stuff just makes it really, really delicious. And that's a full meal right there. So now we just, I shred up some cheese. We'll put some cheese on top of each one. And then we're going to put it in the oven at 350 for approximately 15 minutes. I'll just shred a little bit more to put on the top of that one and it'll go into the oven. Oh, it looks so good and the spices smell so good on here. So it's been in the oven for 15 minutes. Um, it's nice and warm and I'm putting a approximately a tablespoon of guacamole on the top of the pepper and then just a dab of sour cream. I actually forgot to put my shredded cheese on top. It is so tasty. I think you're really going to enjoy it. So here is my low carb stuffed taco pepper. It is very delicious and, and you'll see that I've put the romaine lettuce around because it just the whole combination together is really, really nice. Mm, it's really good. The carb count is a little bit higher on this, but it's still a very healthy meal to be, be eating. So if you like this recipe, go to lowcarbrecipeideas.com. Try this recipe and uh, try some of my other ones. You take care and I'll see you in the next video.